Hey guys, welcome to my new video. In this video, I will show to make this animation with After Effects. Let's get started. So guys, welcome back and in this video, I will show you very easy way for make falling animation. First one, select this background layer and lock here. Then select this layer 7 and let's press P. Open here and make new person keyframe. And let's move it down a little bit. Then go to 10 keyframes. For shortcut, you can use hold shift, press page down in keyboard. Or let me show other way for go to 10 keyframes, click time duration, and right here plus 10. And click OK for go to 10 keyframes. And let's move it up like this. Okay, so in this time, go to 10 keyframes again. Select first keyframe, let's copy pass and select the last keyframe, moved up like this. Okay, let's select this layer 7 and layer line, go to solo and let's zoom in here. Let's see. Okay, and go to three keyframes. For go to frame by frame keyframes, use page down in keyboard. One, two, three. And let's move it up like this go to three keyframes again one two three select this keyframe copy pass and select all keyframes make easy ease or click f9 and let's animation okay we have problem with keyframe interpolations select all these keyframes right mouse go to keyframe interpolation and change color settings to linear click ok let's say again ok nice so, go to select this middle keyframe and move it down a little bit. Very nice. So, select these keyframes, go to graph editor, let's make falling graph and zoom in keyframes like this and select this middle keyframe. Let's move to left and move to right. Select this last keyframe, move to right. Let's say right now. Okay, that's good. This way, realistic filing animation. And back to keyframes. Let's go to first second and let's hold shift, press air, open rotation, make rotation keyframe, and change rotation minus six. And go to here, change three, and go to next keyframe, change minus one, and next keyframe, change zero. Select rotation keyframes, make easy. And let's see. Nice, very good. Okay, so in this time, select this layer 7 and hold shift, press S and change scale 0. Make scale keyframe and go to here, change scale 100%. Select scale keyframes, make easy. Let's animation. Okay, that's good. Select the last scale keyframe, move to left. Okay, that's good. So, select these all keyframes, all position, scale, and rotation keyframes. Let's copy with Ctrl C and select this layer 6. Let's go to solo and go to first second, Ctrl V for pass. Okay, and let's say animation. Okay, and select this layer 6. Let's press P. Select all position keyframes, go to last position keyframe, and in last position keyframe, let's move it up. Okay, let's see. Nice, and select layer 6, let's move right a little bit for step by step animations. Okay, not bad. And let's select this layer 5, go to solo, and go to first second. Again, Ctrl V from layer 7 keyframes. And let's see. Okay, let's press P again, select all position keyframes, go to last position keyframe and move up. And select this layer 5, move right here. Let's see. Nice. And go to last keyframe, select this position keyframes again and move to down. Very nice. And let's select this layer 4, go to solo. And go to first second, control V keyframes again from layer 7 and press P, select position keyframes, 
go to here okay let's select the layer 4 move to right here and select position two frames go to last position two frame and move it up let's see nice and select the layer 3 go to solo and go to first second again control v two frames and press p let's move to right this layer and select all position two frames go to last position and select all position moved up let's again nice and select this layer 2 go to solo go to first second control v for two frames and press p move to right this layer select position two frames go to last position and moved up let's see okay that's good and finally select this layer one go to solo and go to first second control v for past two frames and press p select position two frames and let's move to right this layer okay select position two frames again go to last two frame and moved up okay let's say again okay that's good and in this time select these layers move to left for fast animation okay that's good so let's select all these layers and close two frames and unsolo select this line also unsolo and in this time let's go to solo line layer let's zoom in here and go to pen tool let's make mask like this clization tool and go to fx presses search fx stroke select stroke effect from generate folder and let's use for line and go to first second change pen style reveal original image and change end zero make end two frame and select line press u for c active two frames and go to here change end 100 percent let's see okay and let's change brush size for c all lines let's say again okay say two frames make easy go to graph editor select this graph let's make graph like this and this okay back to two frames and let's unsolo this layer let's see full screen nice and in this time go to last two frame and let's create new null object for control object scales let's create null and hold control double click pen behind icon for move anchor point center kill session tool select these all layers let's link to null object select null and let's go to here and press s change scale and move to down let's see okay that's good so guys thank you for watching my video and don't forget to subscribe channel like video and please follow me on instagram good luck